viewer comments. Viewer comments. My favorite part? Oh, that's pretty cool. It's probably my favorite part, too. What's the first one, Ryan? It's from Jay-Z. The oh. Jay-Z's watching your show? Yeah, shout out. No way. It's probably, probably a different guy. It might be the real Jay-Z. Could be the real He probably has like a, a fake profile because he doesn't want to be like broadcasting to the world that he's a freaking Comic fan of the nerd. show. That's right. Forget the comic book content that is next level. This video, which is our last week's podcast, this video wins solely on the ability to reference three TV shows that are outstanding, The Office, Parks and Recreation, and Lost for the trifecta. That's right. In that order. I had to shout that one. Yeah, in terms of... uh, Quality. Worst to best. And funniest. Yeah. Best acting. Lost is also the funniest. And most like replayability. Absolutely, Ryan. Mm -hmm. I agree. Wait a minute. Hold on. Nah. Uh, <laughs> son of a biscuit. <laughs> All right. What's the next viewer comment? From Daily Gron. This is about the uh, the section of our last podcast from the thieves, the comic book thieves. Oh, the worst. Hmm. The thief cherry picked some valuable Golden Age comics. Someone who knew what they were grabbing, like some kind of, I don't know, Golden Age guru. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Me? <laughs> I was there. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. He was in the. Uh. You were there, dude. Uh. I was. That's terrible, man. I remember. Uh, Richie's a good guy. And oh, you know his, him? Yeah. And, and oh, his wife. I didn't is, know that. Uh, his wife's uh. freaking amazing. She's a doll. And their son's name is Jeff, too. So it's pretty Dang. awesome. Dang it. That's like seriously surprising me that you knew him. But That's I'm a also, solid alibi. Yeah. For it's probably not Jeff. <laughs> it's, no. There you go. And I don't think those books were as cherry picked as you think they are. Yes. Yeah. Those are some random freaking books, and I know how the setup works, so I just uh, I think it was just kind of grab what's there because that's insider information yeah. too. I'm starting just, to really think it's Jeff. I'm yeah, to really <laughs> think we have the thief right here. Yeah, you guys never met Richie. Oh man, no, I didn't. You got to introduce me, man. That's that's interesting that you know him. And sorry to Richie, geez, like that hits close to home, and it makes it that much worse. So hope you get your ASMs back and all that other golden age goodness. Sir, Glad sir. we were able to help shine a light on that last week. Third comment: Raven homicide. Kate's is killing it on Twitter right now about Dylan. This ties into what we were talking about earlier. Yeah. He says, issue seven is first appearance, not nine. And I'm sorry, but the market does not dictate this. The market does not own the IP. That's like telling Disney that Shadows of the Empire is still canon. Oh, man. Star Wars talk. That, that hits a little close to home. I love Shadows of the Empire. If Marvel says 180 is the first, it's 180. Now I wait for ASM 299, first Venom. Well, this is extremely, extremely relevant. It's almost like I picked it for a reason. That's right. But, <laughs> but here's the issue. Like they've already, they've contradicted themselves. All of them have, including Marvel. You know, they've said that it's a cameo. They've said it's a first appearance. It's all problematic. You but, can't win, and it's just going to, it's just going to continue for for the rest of time. The debate rages on. But we're going to be here, and we're going to keep reporting on it. Fourth comment: Gordon Yarn Junior. Ultrasound of your baby versus actual baby. <laughs> first full appearance, always. <laughs> I love it. That one was really good. That's really good. I like that one. Which one is the first appearance? <laughs> Technically, that's like a cameo, right, of your, of your baby versus, you know, the actual first glorious full appearance of your, your new child. All right. I don't know. You're the dad at this table, Jeff. What do you think? Oh, it was real the second I saw a photo. Yeah. See? Oh, my I, God. Look okay. at this. Just so you know, oh. it got really real the second you saw oh a photo. Oh, my gosh. Your, I got chills just now. Just uh-huh. letting you know. Oh, man. But not as real it was when that baby came out. See, the debate <laughs> rages on. No drive was more stressful for me than the drive home from the hospital with the baby for the first time. Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh! It seemed I like everybody. Yeah, it seemed like everybody was going a million hours per, hours per hour. Slow a, down! A million miles per hour when you're just trying to get home. And everyone looks like a reckless driver, and then now you have to like parent without any nurse help and like go. I love these like personal types of stories. I didn't even know about that. And if yeah. you like these types of personal stories, we're gonna do a special after show because you know we do it every single week after the show ends it doesn't actually end we turn the cameras off we keep talking because this show is broadcasted on spotify stitcher soundcloud and itunes and we have some more segments that we keep talking and today we're going to talk about what we like to do when it's not comic books wow other things that we enjoy so if you want to hear that portion head over to the audio portion check it out we're gonna be talking about ourselves We hope you enjoy it.